six packs in a big bag of ice. The intro six packs in a big bag of ice. This is going to be a very quick video. I just wanted to show you the process for installing one of these welding spuds. We've got a quarter keg here that we want to put a half inch welding spud into, and that'll be for a temperature probe. This is what the welding spud looks like. I drilled a inch and an eighth, or one and one eighth inch hole in the quarter keg. Uh, cleaned up the burrs and scuffed up the surrounding surface area with some sandpaper. And I also scuffed up the back of the spud. Wipe both surfaces down with some acetone or some lacquer thinner. We have Harris Stay Bright number 8 and this is an, uh, a 1 8 cross-sectional diameter. You can get these in 16th also. And uh, if you had a 16th of an inch solder, you probably want to put a couple more turns, um, maybe two or three concentric circles. All right, then you're going to use some Harris Stay Clean Liquid Flux. You're going to apply flux to both the keg surface here as well as the back of this. And uh, once you have that flux on there, you flip this over and you put this in that approximate area where the hole is. And uh, then you want to take either your map gas or propane torch and apply heat to the keg in a general area of this uh, where the spud's going to go just to get the whole keg warmed up. And then you can start focusing your heat directly onto the spud. Try not to overheat in the area where the solder is because you don't want to melt the solder with the flame. You want to melt it with the heat that's... Uh, coming from the metal itself and uh, you'll notice when the solder starts liquefying this is going to drop down into the hole you might want to apply a little bit of extra solder if you see any gaps just for cosmetic purposes but once this thing drops down you're gonna have that entire ring of solder uh, making good contact with both surfaces and you're pretty much leak free at that point really any additional solder will be for cosmetic purposes only if you're having trouble getting that solder to flow into the spots, it's probably because you've overcooked the uh, the flux. What you can do is have a, uh, a dropper or a pipette uh, filled with the solder and apply it as necessary.